Indonesia. Kembali lagi sama aku Brand Ambassador Cindy Monica Indonesia. Kali ini kita kedatangan tamu spesial loh. So, let let's get to know them first. So, in my right, there is Mr. Makelau. He is the director of sales marketing Asia Pacific, Japan and Korea. And what about in my left? My left is Mr. Ryan Sim. He is the channel sales director of India. So today we just want to talk about my experience in Ryzen 7, Ryzen 5 and we want to know what about the next projects in the near future. So me playing games like PUBG or Dota 2 makes me really, well it's really fast, it's really comfortable, it's cool and I think that I'm really, I'm really in this Ryzen, in this AMD project. So I want to know for Mr. Lau and Mr. My, Mr. Ryan, uh, how's business? In 2017, how's the innovation? 2017 has been a very good year for AMD uh, in the world as well as in Indonesia, right? Uh, worldwide, we, we have tremendous growth in 2017. Uh, we just launched a bumper year for AMD. We launched over 10 new product family, right? Uh, the Ryzen family, Ryzen 3, 5, 7, uh, Threadripper, we launched Vega 56, Vega 64, uh, the Epic server processor, we launched it recently as well. Uh, last month we did a launch in Jakarta, the Ryzen Mobile, so it's, it's a big, huge year for MD2017, right? Uh, we see tremendous market share growth in Indonesia. Uh, thank you to the Indonesian uh, customer, and user. Uh, but 2018 will be bigger, will be better. Uh, more new products is coming in 2018. Okay, so we want to hear about how about your opinion, Mr. Michael? Yes, uh, from the overall APJ point of view, of course, uh, Ryzen has been an unprecedented uh, successful product. Uh, we made uh, very big progress in Korea, uh, same as in Japan and uh, Australia and New Zealand. And we also make some uh, progress in India. You know, India used to be you know, selling a very low-end product, but they are now selling Ryzen. So, uh, in terms of the gaming performance, of course, uh, Ryzen has a very good performance uh, in some games. And uh, for some popular games, we are in discussion with those uh, game developers and try to optimize it. So, user, you can expect uh, more in, in, uh, performance improvement coming in. Okay, so the next question is that we want to know, maybe a sneak peek or a hint, what do you want to give in 2018? Like, what kind of product? Will there be a surprise? Uh, I think more of a good thing, right, Michael? We're gonna do, uh, we're gonna launch more of a new good things, right? Uh, we can't reveal much, right? But I think we're gonna uh, try to uh, cut the gap in some of the product roadmap. We, we have new products coming out in 2018, very very soon as well, right? Uh, we, we hope that product will help us to expand uh, our channel reach in the market. Anything to add, Michael? Yeah, I think uh, 2018 we should have more exciting product coming in, right? Uh, Intel introducing the new product this year, but they are just following our steps. Uh, actually, they are introducing more cores as we did uh, in Ryzen. And uh, in 2018, definitely there will be some refresh. And also, uh, we are going to have some more new products that provide the end user more values and more performance. Because uh, in the 2018, Gaming will continue to be a very important market. Uh, therefore, we will we uh, we will have the product to address that demands, definitely. Okay, so how about the market here? We want to say not just gamers, right? Well, how do you how do you introduce AMD to other marketing, not just in gamers? Mm, okay. Uh, yeah. So recently, very good question. Uh, recently, we just had an event uh, on the workstation solution. Uh, this is something that uh, the Ryzen family is, is uh, very capable to cover, right? Uh, we, the Ryzen, as you are aware, is a compute-intensive uh, CPU that can cover heavy threads, right? multi-thread application, heavy workloads application, right? In content creation, uh, video encoding, uh, video rendering, 3D simulation, right? Uh, all these uh, multi-threaded application, uh, the Ryzen family product is very capable uh, to manage all these applications. Right, uh, I think we beat the competitor in most all the benchmark right now, right on this kind of application. So we feel very good. Uh, this is a new segment of market that we have not been able to cover, and with the Ryzen family today, we are able to cover that market. So that's another segment of the market other than gaming, the enthusiast market that we are trying to explore right now. Yes, definitely, the professional market is another opportunity for AMD. 
Uh, besides that, let's go further up, right? Uh, we also introduced the uh, APIC this year. So not only on the desktop side, but we also make uh, very good progress on the commercial uh, field. And we also have the Ryzen Pro that can address some of the commercial demands. So I think the market is there and uh, we are making uh, progress on those markets. And I believe that AMD will do it better and better. Okay. okay, so many consumers want more surprises from AMD. And I heard some rumors that you want to make a surprise in programming users. What do you think about that? Ah, okay, so you heard about it. That's, yeah. that's very good. <laughs> uh, okay, we, I think in a few days time, the, our local AMD Indonesian team uh, will announce something exciting. Uh, it's it's an end user contest. Right? Uh, you'll be eligible for uh, all Ryzen and Radeon purchases of AMD, mm -hmm. right? Uh, for the next four months, we have this end user contest. The grand prize is a winner will be selected to go to World Cup to watch a World Cup game in Russia, right? So, so this is a big contest. Uh, I know Sepak Bola is very big yes. in Indonesia. So, so this is something that will get AMD right to be recognized with uh, everyone in Indonesia. Yeah. So hear more about it from our Indonesia team. Stay tuned. Okay, Mr. Michael, Mr. Ryan. Aku akan kasih tahu kalau kita akan ada giveaway dengan hadiah menarik Caranya lihat deskripsi di bawah Dan jangan lupa untuk like dan subscribe channel Youtube AMD Indonesia